How is it going everybody? You're watching Then About Tech and today I'm going to show you how to clear your iPhone RAM memory and of course make it faster. Please keep in mind that this video is universal so it'll work on any and all iPhone models. Okay, so let me go ahead and open up Safari real quick because with the help of Gemini I want to quickly tell you what RAM memory actually is or remind you. So, random access memory, RAM, is a computer's temporary storage for data that's needed quickly. So what it is pretty much is a type of storage which is different from your typical storage that you store your apps and your photos and your files because this is temporary which means that it's constantly being filled and cleared in order to help the CPU, in order to help the processor. So the fuller it is, the more data it has, the worse your performance will be. So that's why in this video, I'm gonna help you out and teach you how to clear the maximum of your RAM memory possible. And of course, make your iPhone faster because your CPU, your processor will be faster as well. All right, so that's pretty much how it works. All you have to do guys for this is download an app. So let's open up the app store and then let's go ahead here and open up the search and then tap on search once again and go for CPU space X. So CPU X. As you can see, that's how the app looks like. So let's open it up. And of course, I'll have a direct link in the description down below so you can tap on it and then you're gonna come straight to this page. Also, naturally, this is a free app, so you don't have to worry about it, all right? So go ahead and download it. It's gonna be 100% free, let it do its thing, and then let's go ahead and open it up. As you can see right here, it's gonna ask for permissions for your location. You can allow while using the app if you want to. Also Bluetooth and also Wi-Fi and so on you can allow. You can super trust this app, okay? And here, reduce irrelevant ads. It's gonna talk about ads. Always choose to ask app, not to track. Okay, and then that's pretty much it. And that's how they make their money, of course, with ads. So as easy as that, you can just go ahead and skip and continue to app, and then it's just gonna skip super quick. And that's why the app is free, right? Okay, so what matters to us is actually this option right here called memory. As you can see, I've got here eight gigabytes. My full, my total uh, memory is eight gigabytes of RAM memory. That's because this is an iPhone 15 Pro Max. This will vary depending on your iPhone model. But again, the process is exactly the same for everyone, as I mentioned. What we need to do is take a look here. So I'm using currently 98%, a little bit over 19% of my memory, and that's not really making my iPhone fast. So what I have to do is tap here on the first option, which is free up. Okay, so tap on the first option. It's gonna start optimizing the memory, as you can see right here. Optimizing, optimizing, and so on. Free up, okay, and then, then we tap here on depth free, as you can see on the second option. And then it's gonna depth optimizing memory, it's gonna uh, do the process once again and really clear the maximum possible. And as you can see, now we've got 86%. So we have reduced pretty much like 12% or even more of our total RAM memory. We have cleared a ton of it like uh, hundreds and hundreds of megabytes, which is super relevant on a eight, six or four gigabyte of total memory, right? A few hundred megabytes is a lot when we're talking about percentages. So that's it guys, that's the process. Please keep in mind that this is not a permanent fix. As you can imagine, after a few minutes, your RAM memory will again start being filled once again, because that's how it works. But this will really, really, really help you out if you're feeling like your iPhone is super slow, is like apps are crashing and so on. So this will give you a temporary fix for scenarios like that, which will make your iPhone faster, just like any other RAM clearing process that you have on a computer or on any other device. It's always like that. We clear, then it fills up again. But at least we managed to clear it a super easy way, completely free. And of course, this will help you out and make your iPhone faster. All right? So that's it. Thanks for watching. And I'll see you on the next video, guys. Bye-bye.